I just unlocked it. It's ahead of the vlog. What up, vlog? We're going to lunch and we haven't been properly grocery shopping in five, six weeks. weeks. Yeah, since racing started. So we're home for like three days, so we're gonna go to Trader Joe's and stock up. I think I wanna go get a coffee. Ooh, I'm craving coffee today. I almost went to Starbucks after the gym. I was like, that's not necessary. So I didn't. You proud of me? Proud of you. You proud of me to go into the gym? Yeah, have you eaten today? Yes. Other than the two cookies you ate this morning? No. Yeah. That's not that good. Yeah, but we're going to eat now. I'm going to go get a pizza. We're going to get a salad. Yeah, I like the their, uh, what's it called? It's like called the goat and vine salad. It's pretty bomb. It's got like pulled chicken and I think it's got like some sort of nuts on it. Does it have on it? I don't remember. Is it like a know. sweet salad? Like does it have like cranberries on Sort it? of, yeah. I like it. I don't like sweet salads. I know you know. You know what's so bomb there? Let me think. They have those. Oh, is it the pretzel? Oh. The pretzels? Mmm. And their hummus it's plate. It's like a big baked pretzel, but it's like super, like, fluffy. It's so good. And then the sauce, the cheese sauce that you dip it in, it's like, what kind of cheese is it? It's like a Parmesan. It's like a. Type. It's like it seems it's like. It's called a, like pretzel cheese or something. What yeah, is it called? Yeah, but it's like it's like a, it's got a strong flavor like Parmesan. I'll I'll bring the camera in and show you, like mm -hmm. the menu. Oh, I was gonna say, are you gonna get it? No, <laughs> maybe. I might get hummus though. Uh, we always go here like on my birthday. I feel like it's like the birthday spot. We didn't go there for your birthday, but we could go there for like other birthdays. Yeah, I went there for your birthday, we went there for Nicole's birthday. Yep. What did you get? Popeye? I got a Popeye because it has yummy almonds. Caesar. I'm the only one that got a pizza. No dog snacking. And <laughs> <laughs> keep going. Trader Joe's. Why is Trader Joe's so busy at 2 o'clock on a Wednesday? Yeah, right? Successful. I feel like we got so much stuff. We got so much stuff. Every time we drive home from the grocery store, we eat carrots. Car snacks. Huh? Car snacks. Oh. <laughs> we got lots of groceries. All of them. Ooh, Taco Bell. Mmm. Making dinner now, and surprise, surprise, sheet pan veggies, rice and chicken, athlete's dinner. That's all I eat. All I eat. But thank you. I love it. It's like 90 degrees today, so we're going to, wow, that's so pretty. We're gonna sit outside and go in the hot tub and maybe we should turn the fire on. No, it's too hot. Our fire. We got our wedding invitations in, so that's exciting. Here's a sneak peek. And I'm not sure when I'm supposed to send these out because I just did not save the date, so. Don't know what I'm doing. Not a good wedding planner. made such a good fruit bowl and then I just got done and I realized that I didn't vlog it. Then I cut up some fruit and lemon and put some mint in my, oh that scared me. Put some mint in my water and that was a really good breakfast. I love to have like some sort of fruit bowl for breakfast every morning and we went to Trader Joe's yesterday as you guys saw so got a ton of fruit and then got some mint. It's a couple hours later now, and I'm just going to meet my best friend for lunch. Oh, she's gonna go get Italian food. And then I'm gonna go see my other friend because my best friend's getting her hair done by my other friend. And then I'm gonna hang out there for a little bit, and then we have a birthday party tonight. So, busy day. Just got off a call with our wedding venue. Uh, just going over some details for our big day which is crazy. It's coming up so quick and it's making me, it's making me all butterflies. It, do, it doesn't feel real until 
now really because I now have our save the dates out. Just got our invitations in the mail as you guys saw. And then it's just getting closer and it's crazy and I'm so excited. So six month countdown yesterday. 23rd. So so excited. So yeah, I'll bring you guys along for the rest of my day a little bit. I feel like I forgot something. Anyway. See you later. Um, it's literally hours later and I forgot to bring the camera in to the places I went. So very sorry about that. But obviously you guys heard like three seconds ago that I just went to lunch. We have a birthday party to go to. I think I also said that. So I picked up some candy because we're going to a kid's birthday party and obviously I'm the candy queen so I had to provide some candy so I have to go to Sprouts to pick up some of Cameron's favorite bread um, he's gluten free so he has this special bread I don't really know what it's called so hopefully I remember what it's called so I can get the right one but I feel like I've spent all day in the car which is the story of our life pretty much but yeah so I just thought I'd set the camera up and just chit chat with you guys because I'm in here anyway what is your guys' favorite grocery store because I know a lot of people love Sprouts and a lot of people love Trader Joe's I'm a Trader Joe's fan but I love Sprouts too, but like it's so overpriced. Like I just can't justify shopping there. And then there's the Whole Foods, which is like similar route to Sprouts, I feel. Or you have like your Albertson, State of Rose, Publix if you live in that part of the world. I do love Publix. Public subs. What else do they have? I just feel like Publix is good. It's how you know you're an adult when like Groceries are expensive, gas is expensive. I'm driving by a gas station right now, 6.19. 6.19, and I need gas today, and like, I don't want to. I found these at CBS. Oh my gosh, they're really hot. And I already ate them, but I'll do a fake taste test. They're just the blue ones. Mm. They're kind of warm, but kind of good. And then, Paige and I went to the gas station to get more candy. I got these. These are fire. And then um, Lifesaver Gummy Neons. They smell good. Wait, part of me feels like I've had these before. I've also hit every red light possible today. Like, I don't think I could hit any more red lights than I have. We have like two freeways by our house. And where I was, like, I should have gone to the other freeway, which is closer to the Sprouts and I just blanked and didn't and so it's taking me like twice as long to get to Sprouts because I went the wrong way <sighs> which is frustrating but my bad it's a couple days later say hi every time oh, in the spa. you're exposing me on my spa we have spent all day outside in the sun and you can't tell how sunburned I am Right there. You were pretty cocky with the no sunscreen, basically. It's like, it's bad. Really bad. I feel like warm. Yeah, you're from. You're My face feel. didn't get bad though, but. Happen. You're gonna feel. And then. We're gonna have to start I'm over. Gonna be tanner than you. We have this running competition every year of who can get the most tan. It's been since we started dating, because I was well, extremely I tan. I don't tan, ever. No, you just go outside and you tan. I just... You like, tan easily. Cycle and... Yeah, I don't know how he gets so tan. Last week, those Stanley Cups that are really popular, they came back in stock. They came in stock at Target.com and Stanley a couple days later. So I bought one from both websites. All right, let's do an unboxing. Alrighty, this one is... The Target one. Oh, I need a cup. Yes, both of them. So I got a white one from Target. Ah! 
Oh my gosh, it's huge. Babe. <laughs> what are you gonna do with that thing? What do you mean? It's the size of your head. Yeah, I'm gonna be so hydrated. And do you wanna know what it's like famous for? Hmm. Fitting in the cup holder. Okay, so here's the white one. This one's from Target. Ooh. Oh, that one's cute. That's concrete color. I like that one better. It's like a big hole. Should we watch? I could fill that whole thing with iced coffee and just sit there like this. <laughs> See, you know what's what's BS though? What's BS? Stand next. Put your head next to mine. Yeah. Your face is still yeah. thinner than me. Look at my arm. Look at my arm compared to yours. She's been laying out in the in the sun for like four days. Wait, so which one do you like better? The uh, concrete one. Wow, I'm so excited. Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday, yo. Coffee? Every time it's I show so you in the hot. vlog, you have a coffee in your hand. I know. Um, update on my cup. Been wow, loving just... it. Drank two of them since I got it, which is impressive for me because I usually go through like a bottle of water a week. We went to wine country today because it's my papa's birthday. So we went to lunch and... He's awesome. Yes, it was super fun. We went to... I don't remember where we went, but I had pasta and it was so good. He had a salad. And then we went to Peltzer, which is another winery, and just hung out with my papa for a little bit. And then Trader Joe's run, again. Two grocery hauls in one week. Wait, we one week on or two weeks? More on Wednesday. Okay, so. On Wednesday and Sunday. Jeez, we go through a lot of groceries. Well, we had like big groups yeah, over. Yeah, we had twice when we had our parents over. Twice. Our idea of big groups. Our parents. Yeah, our parents. Well, both of them. Anyway, so that's kind of what we've been up to this week. Uh, what else did we do? Outdoor riding. Oh yeah, he started outdoors this week, uh, a little bit. Because we have a couple of weeks off. This coming week and then back to Supercross. And then we're going to St. Louis. Not next weekend, but the weekend after. I have a cold, that's fun. Not COVID, just a cold. I am the health queen of this family, so I did not get it yet. Oh yeah. Oh no. Oh, that's not good. Paramedic. Super. I always do. Me too. I love I'm trying. Coffee. The UV is six. So I'm hoping that we get home in time for me to tan my backside because, oh, I don't think I did a vlog update of my sunburn. It's kind of turning into a tan at this point. But I'm not going to be tanning my front side in the next couple days. We brought Chip with us today and he was good. He was fine. For the most part, yeah. He gets like really overly excited like the first couple minutes we bring him out. And then he chills out. But overall, he out pretty well. he's happy that he didn't have to stay home. Very. Chip, you happy? He hates staying home by himself. He does. He loves to hang out. And just be around. The squad. I'm just doing some painting and whatnot right now. I made this painting like six months ago, honestly. And at the time I meant to make a duplicate of it because I'm going to put them side by side. And I made this like with drywall which is what I made a lot of our house art with but so it's like 3d and then I just painted it so I can't get the drywall open <laughs> I tried with a screwdriver and a towel and I can't get it so I have to wait till Cameron gets back home so I can make a duplicate but oh I also started inventing Anna and it's really good so far so I'm watching that right now but another thing I'm going to be painting today is I want like large canvas, or not canvas, 
large drywall art on both sides of the TV, like two feet by five feet, like pretty big. So I think Cameron's gonna go to Home Depot. And our little hack is to go to Home Depot and get plywood instead of canvases because canvases are like over $100 that size, which is exactly what we did in our dining room. So we just got this huge piece of drywall and I, or sorry, huge piece of plywood. And then I put the drywall on top of it and painted it. And then we put a frame around it. And it's like my favorite piece in the house. My fiddle is dead. I need to get rid of it, ignore it. And then I need a mirror for right here. I want like that black like squiggle mirror, I think. But I haven't even looked for one, so that's my bad. More drywall art I did. I just, it's fun to make and it just has a lot of texture in it, so I love it. But that is what I'm doing today. I am just ready for our house to be like complete. I want it to feel more custom because it's just, uh, it's a builder grade home. So we are just working on doing some things to make it feel more custom to us. We thought about doing like ship shiplap on this wall or like painting it black, but I don't know. The drywall art just seems easier, so. That's what I'm gonna do today and probably tomorrow. And I really hope camera gets back soon because I need to open the drywall container and I can't. So, yeah, it's also raining today, which sucks. Yesterday it was like 90 degrees again. Guys, I am so sunburnt, I cannot explain it. Like everywhere else on my body is like completely fine and turned into a tan already, but like right here. And Chip got thrown in the pool the other day. He usually loves to swim and loves the water, but he hasn't been in our pool yet. And he was mad at us. He just like stared at us. <laughs> it was kind of funny. Update on the art. Cameron is out here just about to paint it. So this is what we're working with. What are these, two by five? Uh, two by five and a half. Five and a half. We're gonna paint them black and then he painted the frame. He's a real one out here doing this. I'm grinding. I had a weird Amazon purchase, so I just wanted to share. Um, my, like these front pieces of my hair just feel like they're getting like a little crispy and I don't want that and I want my hair to stay healthy. So I bought this thing, which I've seen on pretty much everywhere, TikTok, Instagram. It's basically these heatless hair curlers. And you just wear this overnight. It's this like, <laughs> I can't. Should I practice? And then you clip this clip on the top. Is that even gonna stay? Wrapping my hair. I think you do it kind of like a French braid where you like keep adding more and more as you go. Cameron's gonna come in and be like, what are you doing, dude? Oh no, my hair's too long. You can hear it. So this is what it looks like. This looks great. So I'm gonna do it better. I'm gonna take a shower and then I'm gonna put it in there better and probably spray my hair with okay. some water. Maybe that'll help, but good invention. I will update you guys in the morning. We're jamming Blink-182 on the way to the trap. Um, hair update on that thing. I failed. Do I need to turn it down? No, it's fine. Oh, the hair thing failed. It kind of fell out of my hair in the middle of the night. So I'm going to try it again tonight. Got sicky, the Stanley Cup. Sicky Vicky. I've been so. sick since like Friday. It sucks. And we're sharing straws? And you drink my water. Yeah, I know, but there's water in the truck and then there's uh, ice in there. So. so we're going to the track and then I'll end the vlog. Outdoors. Oh yeah, outdoors. Glen Helen. Raw butt cheeks. We've been at the track for a couple hours now, but it's really cold. So I just came and sat in the truck. And this is my view. 
writer, fiance life. Um, but I think that's it for this vlog. I'm going to go edit it when I get back home and hopefully upload it tonight. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this vlog. Let me know if there's any kind of different videos you guys want me to post or anything in the comments below. So yeah, bye!